gonna use all of the best weapons and loadouts of Warzone and rank them. One of my subscribers named 12 Gauge requested that I use my favorite gun and see how well I did. So instead of just using one of my favorite guns, I'm gonna use all of my favorite guns. For the first loadout, I'm gonna be using the Cronin and the Vel. Honestly, I haven't used the Cronin that much, but I put it in today's video because I know it's really good right now. Its accuracy and recoil is pretty good. It's nothing too crazy, but it's got some good range. All right, now let's hop into our first match and get this video started. But first, guys, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you do enjoy these videos. All right, for game one, we're going to land somewhere hot so I can get a good warm-up before I grab my loadout. All right, we got a couple of people here. Actually, we got a lot of people here. There we go. We got one guy with a pistol, and it sounds like people are fighting below me. And we got number two. Guy tried to drop shot me. What were you doing, kid? Can't drop shot me. It doesn't work. Oh, there's another guy. I was literally scratching the back of my head. And I still got him. Okay, we'll just finish him off. Oh, my gosh. There's another guy. How many people are over here? Wait. What the? What was this guy doing? He just let me kill him. What just happened? Oh man, that was hilarious. Well, I would say that's a pretty good warm up for the video. Now let's try to get some money to buy a loadout. Oh, Bruh. oh, I grabbed the wrong loadout. I grabbed the wrong loadout. Oh no, I was doing so well too. Okay, that's fine. We're in the gulag now. Let's just hope we win and then we can grab the free loadout that drops. Oh, we got him, let's go. Okay, this time I'll make sure to grab the right loadout. There it is, Cronin Bell. Okay, all right, we got one guy over here. Ooh, okay, all right, this gun's got some decent accuracy. I'm honestly, mm, I still like the ISO a little bit better. Oh, oh, you gotta come to me, buddy. You're going the wrong way, that's where the gas is. Yeah, I'm gonna cut this guy off. Oh, there was another guy! Oh, dang it. Well, I'm going to give the loadout another chance. I'm going to play another game with it. Oh, nice, nice. We got him. That was the bounty. Well, you know what? The Cronin's starting to grow on me. Oh, here we go. We can airstrike him out of there. Dude, he's not moving. This airstrike's going to kill him. Do your thing, airstrike. Yeah, there we go. Come on. Here we go. Oh, let's go. We got him. Oh, my, my vehicle's about to blow up. My vehicle's about to blow up. And another guy killed me. I'm not really a big fan of the Cronin, so I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10, and I give the MP7 an 8 out of 10. Now, for the second loadout, we're going to change it up a bit by using a sniper. We'll start with the MCPR with these attachments, and then the Vazinev with these attachments as a solid sniper support for the secondary. All right, good range, of course. I mean, it's a sniper. What do you expect? And then the Vaznev has really low recoil, which makes it good for mid-range. Now let's hop into the next match and take down some noobs with the second loadout. There's someone in this building. And we finally got it. Okay, uh, the Vaznev is... Yeah, it's all right. I'm still trying to get used to it. It's another one of these guns I don't really use that often. Oh, whoa, whoa. Where'd you come from, kid? You just popped out of nowhere. I don't know if he's running away from someone because he looked like he was in a hurry. Yep, yep, there is someone. Okay, let's try to get a sniper kill here. Oh, we got a shot on him. Hey, there we go. There we go. Didn't get a sniper kill, but the sniper contributed to that kill. I do like how fast that aim down sight time is for the sniper. Okay, I guess now I can grab that UAV. Nope, nope. Now there's someone else aiming at me. Oh! Oh, he was being shot at by someone else, and I stole that kill. There. Oh. Dude, there's like two people aiming at me. Oh, headshot. Let's go. Now, where's the other guy at? Wait, what? Oh, there's no way. There's no way that guy just stuck me with the grenade. And there it is. There is the end of the game. Yeah, screw it. I don't feel like using that loadout again, so I'm going to move on to the next one. But for that loadout, I'm going to give the sniper a 9 out of 10 because it's pretty quick and it's powerful. The Vaznev, I'm just going to give a 7 out of 10. I'm not a huge fan of it. I don't like the iron sight. This third loadout is actually my personal favorite, which is the ISO hemlock with these attachments to make it a long-range gun, and then a really fast but well-rounded lockman sub for the secondary. The ISO hemlock has good range and recoil, which is exactly... 
exactly what I want out of this primary. And guys, this is why I love the Lockman sub because you see how fast it aims? It is incredibly fast. <laughs> And look at that recoil. Now, let's go ahead and hop into this next match, boys. Let's drive to a really hot spot on the map. I'll go to Al Shreem Pass. It's always a very populated area. What was he doing at the window there? I was not expecting him to be there. He was just kind of standing there waiting for me. Uh, there's a couple people around. Al Shreem Pass is actually pretty dead right now. Ooh, there we go. Gotta kill with both my weapons there. Man, there's something about the ISO hemlock. There's something about it that I like a lot. Man, I really love this combo here. Oh, what are you doing, kid? What are you doing? Driving into trees like that? That stuff gets you killed. Oh, oh, whoa, is someone sniping me? That building right there? Look at that, look at those shots. Man, I love this gun. And now someone is aiming at me from behind. Gosh, why am I always being double teamed? And there is the second guy trying to kill me. Let's go back to the sniper over here. There he is. Where did he go? Oh, he definitely ran away. Oh, 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 what the heck? What was that guy doing there? Oh, that's a bomb drone. What is going on here? There we go. I, I, this is just crazy over here. No, 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 no. Don't shoot me out of the sky. Ah, there we go. Barely got out of that alive. Dude, how many people are aiming at me? Stop. <laughs> no. There were so many people aiming at me there. There was nothing I could do. I really like that loadout, guys. I give both guns a 9 out of 10. All right, guys, I kind of want to have a little bit of fun for this next loadout, so we're going to be using a ride shield. All right, he's stunned. I got him. The ride shield just feels OP, to be honest. <laughs> Especially when you pair it up with the stuns, it just feels so dirty. That guy hasn't moved in a while, so I think he's just camping there. There we go. So who's next? Let's see. Oh, we've got a couple people here. Try to swim away from me, huh? Yeah, that didn't work. All right, let's get this guy on the roof. I think he was sniping, so I don't know if he's really paying attention. My goodness, the ride shield's just so OP. Again, dude, <laughs> like they can't do anything when they're stunned. All right, we got another guy. Oh, he's coming this way. Whoa, 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 where did this guy come from? That's a different guy. Oh no, he's running away. Oh, dang it, I had to reload at the worst time. Oh, there he is, he came back, he came back to me. Oh, let's go. We got him. Okay, 1v1. Hey, can I get a win on my first game using the ride shield? Like I said, this loadout makes it way too easy to win. Oh, I hear him. I think he's above me. Yeah, yeah, he's above me. I can see the shadow. Okay, I'm not taking a chance on that. Oh, and there we go. There it is, guys. There it is. Wow. I mean, I would say it's a 10 out of 10 loadout, but it's the riot shield. You know, I'm giving the riot shield a 5 out of 10. Like, it's really good if you know how to use it, but it's extremely toxic, so you divide it by 2. Now, for the final loadout, I'm going to change it up and make it a little interesting. For the primary, I'm going to use a really low recoil M4. And then for the secondary, I'm using the KV broadside with these attachments. So, for the M4, this thing has absolutely no recoil. Like, look at this. I am not even adjusting the recoil. Like, I'm not even touching the analog stick. Now for the shotgun. The range is pretty bad. All right, now let's get this next match started. All right, I'm excited to try this loadout. I haven't used a shotgun in a long time in Warzone. Okay, so we got two people on the island here. Okay, he's camping up there. All right, we'll fix that. Perfect. 
How did he not see me shoot the window? And there's the other one. Oh, dude, this M4 is so solid. It just tore off his plates like it was nothing. Okay, I, I really like this M4 so far. This is an amazing weapon. Like, it disintegrates people. It doesn't just melt them. It disintegrates them. Oh, there's another one. Oh, good thing he was not very accurate. He missed all of his shots. This M4 is amazing at close range, too. This has got to be the best gun in the game. Like, I really think this M4 is the best gun in the game. Ooh, hello there. Yeah, yeah, I see you. Hiding behind tables. There we go. He was still hiding behind the table. I just had to go around. I could take the redeploy drone and fly to the ocean. Or I can fly to the top of this building here. All right, let's do it. We're going to take it. Can I even reach up there? I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get up there. Oh, I might just be able to do it. I think I will. Dude, yeah, this is the best spot. All I have to do is watch the zip line. Dude, this gun's range is incredible. Who needs snipers when you got this M4? Oh, headshot! Dude, this M4 is amazing! I have fallen in love with the weapon. Uh, his body's floating. That's weird. So I think I do have to leave the building, unfortunately. Oh my gosh, we got him! No! Oh, the gas mask! No! Oh. Okay, guys, I know I didn't get the chance to use the shotgun, but that M4 was just really good. I give the M4 a 10 out of 10 easily. I hope you all enjoyed the video, and if you did, like and subscribe and comment down below your loadout request for the next video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.